Hi there, this is John. In this Ownhammer Workhorse feature focus video, we're going to take a quick look at the different voicing options in the Workhorse V30 IR pack from the Line 6 Marketplace and what their unique characteristics have to offer when it comes to tone. Each cabinet plus speaker model combination is represented through six different capture types or IR voicings. These are related to the microphones involved in the capture process, their placements and their mixture levels where applicable, of which can vary throughout the library from cabinet to cabinet. The high gain voicing provides the most high end cut through and tightest bottom end. The files with this voicing are recommended for higher gain tones through medium to high output humbuckers. Let's listen to a sound example with one of the 4x12 cabinets using the high gain voicing. The mid gain voicing provides a very balanced top and bottom with a slightly pushed mid range. The files with this voicing are recommended for middle of the road tones through low output PAF humbuckers or P90s. Let's take a listen to a sound example with one of the 2x12 cabs using the mid gain voicing. The low gain voicing provides the fattest and fullest bottom end and lower mid range. Files with this voicing are recommended for lower gain tones through single coils. Let's listen to a sound example of a clean tone with one of the 1x12 cabs and the low gain voicing. The solo lead voicing provides a thick and pillowy quality to the presentation, but still with high amounts of focus. These files are recommended for single note solo or lead playing through any pickup configuration. Let's listen to one of the 4x12 cabs with the solo lead voicing. The live sound voicing provides a tried and true workhorse for live sound applications. This voicing is equally suited to any pickup configuration and music style. For the purpose of this demonstration, let's also take a listen to a sound example of this voicing type using one of the 2x12 cab options. <laughs> Within the extended folder found in any given cab or speaker directory are sonic variations of all the IR voicings. Related to mic placement, these range from 1, which is the brightest, to 5, which is the darkest. These numeric units are an arbitrary sequential ordering and do not infer any manner of measurement data with regards to exact placement. <laughs> To conserve necessary character length space, the extended folder IR voicings have been abbreviated. Position 3 for every voicing type is what is found as an identical copy-paste in the cabinet plus speaker directory with the full IR voicing name, so without the position number 3 notation. IR files in the summary folder find themselves at a sonic middle ground when compared with the above. All voicing names are merely suggestions. Experimentation is recommended, as results will inevitably vary. And that's all for this video. For more information about the Ownhammer Workhorse IR packs, please visit ownhammer.com/line6 or the link in the description. Thanks and cheers.